Today I'm going to show you a brief overview of the GitHub integration with Jira software. As you can see here, we're looking at a done bug in the soft project. When connected to GitHub or Bitbucket or other development tools, Jira issues will gain a new development panel down here in the bottom right, showing information such as the number of branches, commits, and pull requests that are related to this ticket. But let's see what this looks like from the beginning. As you can see, the development panel is missing on this bug. That's because no development work has been performed on it. So to get started, let's open up SourceTree, which is Atlassian's free Git client, and create a new branch. And while we're at it, We'll go ahead and open up the README and add some new text. Source tree will automatically pick up those changes, allowing us to add them to the staged files. Before we commit, we'll add the Jira issue key of the bug we are working on, which is soft7. And we'll also push these changes immediately. Looking back at the Jira issue, we can now see that there is a new branch and a new commit. You can also see that our bug status has changed to in progress. This happened automatically when the branch was created. And if you're watching closely, we now have a link to create a pull request directly in Jira. We'll open this up in a new tab, which takes us to GitHub. We'll select the branch and create our pull request. Now that the pull request has been created, you can see the pull request in the development panel. Finally, we'll go back to GitHub and we'll merge the pull request. Now we can see that the pull request has been merged. We have a second commit for the merge and the Jira bug has automatically been closed. Thank you for joining us for this brief overview of the GitHub integration with Jira software.